that's it. Off and racing this opening race of the afternoon here in Fairy House and first to show. It is Room at the Tide. Leads by the best part of two and a half lengths from Moon Deed in second. They're followed in third by Head and Heart. And complete the field of four is Kilbunny Bontic as they swing the bend and make their way across towards the side of the track. Continue to run towards the next fence, which will be fence number two. As they do so, run with the tide. The only one of this field with a previous run leads the way. Luke Murphy by the best part of four or five lengths from in second. Good jump by Moon D. These are followed next in the field, back in third by Head and Heart. And completing the field of four, it is Kilbunny Bontek. So they swing, make the way up the home straight for the first time. They'll be turning a bend and up towards the next fence they're jumping, which will be fence number three. As it do so, it is in front. Rumba to Tide leads the way from Moon D back in second. Head and Heart is third, and completing the field of four is Kilbunny Bontek. Straighten up off the bend and on towards this next fence, fence number three. And as it do so, good jump by your leader. Over safely, run with the tide from Moondy in second. They've closed up now. Followed back in third by Heather Hart and Alinta Drift. And the back marker of the quartet it is Kilbunny Bontic. So they pass the judge's trailer for the first time. Head up to the bend to bring them right handed now and head up to a hill towards the highest point of the track and racing on towards their next fence, which will be fence and number four. And as they do so, run with the tide, leads the way by two lengths from Moondy in second and Barry O'Neill, followed in third by Head and Hart, and two and a half lengths, the back marker of the four, it is Kilbunny Bontic. Over that fence, fence number four, and all four mares jumping very well to this point, as they head to the bin to bring them back over towards their point of departure, and head on towards the next fence they're jumping, which will be fence number five. And as they do so, it is in front, run with the tide from Moondy, with two and a half lengths of drift in second, further length back to the third, hit her heart, and they're followed by Kilbunny Bontic. So they pass the point of departure, they're five jumped, and quickly race on towards the next fence, which will be fence number six, right over the far side now, and it is run with the tide, leads the way, coming to it again, a good jump by our leader from Moondy in second. Head and heart is third, and there's a break of about four lengths back to the back marker, Kilbunny Bontic. Swinging a bend towards the side of the track, and racing on towards their next fence, which will be fence number seven. And as they do so, run with the tide. Luke Murphy leads the way by about three, four lengths from Moondy in second, Barry O'Neill. Head and heart is in third, Jimmy Codd, and Kilbunny Bontic is the back marker. Michael O'Sullivan. Over that fence, fence number seven. I continue the way back towards the home straight. For the second time, they'll be turning in towards this next fence, which will be fence number eight, and the last in a circus time. So as they take the bend, it is run with the tide by two and a half from Moonded in second. They follow the length for the back in third by head and heart. And there's three lengths back to the back marker, Kilbunny Bontic. Heading up towards this next fence, fence number eight, and it is Run With The Tide by two and a half. And Munded in second, as they come towards this fence, Run With The Tide, again a good jump by our leader, is over from Munded in second. They're followed in third by Head and Heart, and completing the field, three lengths adrift is Kilbunny Bontic. They pass the judges trailer, head out to the final circuit with five and all left to jump. And as they head towards the bend to bring him up, the hill towards the fence that will be five from the finish, it is Run with the tide from Munded in second. Head and heart is third. Kilbunny Bontic, there's no changing the running order since the drop of the flag. All four mares still in with every chance as they race on and up the tempo towards this fence. It'll be five from the finish. As they do so, run with the tide. Go jump by your leader from Munded in second. Head and heart is third, and they've just drawn on three or four clear of the back marker, Kilbunny Bontic. Bring him into the back straight this final time and racing on towards this fence. The fence will be four from the finish and a still run with the tide. 
Heading for home now from Munded in second. Head and hat third. Three lengths back to the back market, Kilbunny Bontic. Four out. Good jump again by their leader. From in second, Munded. They're followed by Head and Hart, who's just nudged along for a few strides, Jamie Codd. Kilbunny Bontic is back in four, the back marker, as they race on towards this next fence. And the fence will be three from the finish as they do so. Run with the tide is over from Munded in second. Head and Hart is back in third. Kilbunny Bontic is four. They head towards the bend to move across the side of the track and race on towards this fence two from the finish. The leader, Run with the Tide, still shows the way as they head for home from Munded in second. Head and Hart third and they're followed by Kil Kilbunny Bontic who's closed right up now. The four mares are only separated by six lengths as they race on towards this fence two from the finish. As they do so, Run with the Tide, again a good jump over from Head and Hart. Kilbunny Bontic has now gone into second. Head and Hart's third, Munded is ridden back in four. But the head around the home bend this final time, swing in with just one left to jump in this opening golf sponsored four year old mares maiden. And as it do so, run with the tide, leads the way now. Still travels well in front from Kilbunny Bontic, who's back in second. Head and heart is third. Munda has dropped right out in four. Off the home bit, they come to straighten up Luke Murphy. Travels well, has a look over his shoulder as they straighten up towards this final fence. He's the best part of five lengths clear now at the last as run with the tide comes to it. Over safely from head and heart in second. Faller to last was Kilbunny Bontic winning third, but up towards the line. Run with the tide wins. Hands and heels to the line. Wins impressive for Sean Doyle. Luke Murphy, head and heart runs a cracker in second. And there are only two finishers. Veterinary assistance to the last, please. Veterinary assistance to the last, please.